welcome to Help Desk with Joe, and with me as always is Joe. And we're back. You're not wearing a Santa hat, but we're rolling into Christmas. It's getting close. I getting might close. break it out before Christmas. You never know. Okay, so maybe next week we'll have the Christmas show. Maybe. Maybe. Okay, so that'll give you something to look forward to next week. Or not. Or not, because <laughs> it's a maybe. You know how that goes. Uh, so this week, uh, you know, as usual, you do some sort of product review to help people be more efficient with their technology uses, solve some problems with their technology uses, or better protect themselves by using technology of some sort. And uh, what category does this week fit in? Uh, this is more of a prevention, disaster recovery, uh, uh, taking care of a problem before it starts kind of. Right. Okay. So, and you lecture me this all the time with what we do. We always need to protect our information. Right. Make sure we don't lose our information. And so I get to spiel about once a month. Yeah, you and, and I've uh, preached. I've had many <laughs> preachers. <presents. laughs> so, uh, and we actually, uh, you installed this project. Or product for us as well, so I have first-hand experience, which is a rarity. Usually, I don't know what we're going to review or talk about, so that makes it nice. Right, and I always just tell you to trust me on it, and, and it'll all be fine. Yep. So, today, uh, tell us what we're going to talk about. Okay, today we're going to discuss the product called Carbonite. It's an online backup solution for both home and business. Right, and um, as I say, I'm familiar with it. You have us uh, working with it for our end. We said we don't lose any of our valuable information. Right. And uh, it works well. So let's talk a little bit about what it is exactly. Now, as you said, it's an online backup system. Right. What is it exactly? Okay. In a previous shows, you know, I always refer back to the 3 2 one solution. Three copies of your data right. on two different media formats, one being off-site. But with Carbonite, it takes care of two of the three. Right. So it takes care of the two different formats, and it also takes care of the off-site since it's on the Internet. What it does is... You download the program, you pay, you know, you pay your subscription, you get all that set up, and then you can go in there and tell it exactly what data you want to back up. Now you right. can't back up your programs, but you can back up your critical data, you know, anywhere from pictures to Excel spreadsheets, Word documents, stuff like that. You can tell it to back it up, and what it does is it backs it up to the internet. So heaven forbid something happens, you accidentally delete a file, your computer crashes, all you have to do is log back in and start downloading your data back. If you're like we used to do, you'd have your Breaking rule number two, have it somewhere else. Right. <laughs> we have backup copies, but it was always in the same place as our original copies. So. You always set it right there in the drawer, right beside the computer. Right, yeah, <laughs> yeah. So we broke rule two, which I know you always yell at me for. Uh, so it solved that problem. Right. And it was handy and it's easy. So um, what does it actually do? And I know you said it backs up. It backs it up to the Internet. How does that process work? Okay. Walk, walk them through that. Because I, I was really in, uh, entranced with how it worked and how easy it was. Okay. So how it works is you install the software, and first it does just a quick scan of your computer, mostly like your My Documents, your desktop, stuff like that, to see what folders have files in them that you find important. And then if you have any folders that's not in the typical areas, like your My Documents and My Videos, My Music, stuff like that, you can go back in there and right-click and tell it to save those folders. Right. So once you do that, what it does is it takes a copy of those files and saves them on the cloud or the Internet on Carbonite servers. And before you... Uh, freak out as far as security goes. Uh, Carbonite is one of the top notch. Right. As far as security goes, they are actually HIPAA compliant. Yep. So, you know, if you're not familiar with HIPAA, HIPAA is the Health Information Patient Privacy Act. If you are a patient in a hospital, that act uh, is that law is in place to protect your medical records from being accessed to anybody in the world. So, if they're good enough to hold my medical records that are good enough to hold my data. Right, and that's what we talked about. We work a lot with the Department of Education and the data is sensitive. Right. And uh, so we had to have something that covered those bases and Carbonite does. Right. So that made it very nice. Um, now, as far as how long would a person uh, expect to utilize it, uh, have it update their files and so forth, give us some duration over okay. there. What's nice is uh, we didn't, I wasn't aware of this until a while back. Uh, Cena was doing a spreadsheet. And she actually saved and overwrote six months worth of data. Right. One nice feature this thing does, it does file versioning. Well, file versioning is every time you update a file, it saves a new copy of that file. It doesn't overwrite your file. It just right. saves a new copy. So you can always go back to that older copy if for some reason down the road, six months down the road, you found that you just deleted half of your data. Right. So you can go back to it. And then mine updates, uh, I want to say, one evening a week. You set it for one evening a week when we knew we'd leave our computer on it would update. Right. Yeah, you can set it up on a time schedule. You, you can set it up to back up all the time, or you can set it up to back up just in the evening time or just the weekends, so whatever's convenient for you. But yep. what's nice is it runs in the background, so there's no must, no fuss, no hassle yep. of trying to remember how to do it. Right. It takes care of itself. 
right. beautiful thing. Um, what are some of the benefits to having that program? And I know you've covered a laundry list already. But right. Some of the unseen benefits. One, I can sleep at night. <laughs> <laughs> yep. You know you can always go back and get your information. Right. You have that rule two and three, a separate copy and off-site. Right. Two, ease of use. I mean, it's literally, you know, install it, and it w walks you right through all the steps, and it even has just, if you're not real computer savvy, you know you have all your documents and your My Documents or your My Pictures and stuff like right. that, you can just do it with the Express settings, and by default, it sets those folders in for backup. And what's nice is, you know, a lot of people say, yeah, I have a backup. I think I'm backing up. I'm not sure. With Carbonite, you know. I mean, right. there's no wonder if it's... Amber collar, that means it's not backed up yet or it's going to be backed up. If there's a little green dot beside the file itself, you know it's backed up. And I got curious. I went and looked, and it has a little pull-up menu screen, and you can see what's backed up what's not Right. when it's scheduled to be backed up. So it's really easy to use on that. Right. Is there anyone that this wouldn't work for? The people that it wouldn't work for now, you know, I mentioned that it does. They do have home consumer side as well as business side, which we'll discuss further in a little bit. But the people that I would... Uh, steer against this would be uh, people that have uh, bandwidth internet that has cap data cap limits like hotspot or satellite internet dial if you have dial up internet oh, yeah. you know that's definitely out that's already a given yeah. so if you have those two I, as much as I hate to say it you have to steer clear of that or if you have a lot of data like terabytes upon terabytes of data definitely against carbonite because you have just so much data yeah. but uh, on their site, they actually have a, you know, you can contact them, and they actually have solutions set up to work with you as far as, you know, using terabytes upon terabytes of data. Right. So there are some guidelines, and, you know, as with anything, if you're going to use a heavy program, it's going to do you a lot of good. It's going to take some resources. Right. So, okay, and uh, let's talk a little bit about, uh, you mentioned the consumer side and the business side. Right. Um, what are the pricing differences, and what should people look for? Okay. For consumer side, the way... Carbonite has their pricing scheme set up as of this recording. You know, things might change, so sure, just sure. let everybody know that as of this recording, uh, the pricing is typically $49 per year per device for consumer side, which, in all honesty, that's a small price to pay because all it takes is one snafu and you've lost 10 years of pictures of your kids and then your wife's all over you. <laughs> you know, why didn't you back Nobody wants that. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> and, and, you know, and, and literally, a flood, a tree fall, anything. Lightning strike. Well, some what what could you know happen? I and mean, you'd say, "Well, I'm gonna roll the dice." Yeah. So just that's how I look at it. Well, it's something simple as a power surge or a brownout, right. power fluctuation. That's all it takes. Yep. And you'll be stuck because it's hard anymore. People don't do photo ops. Right. And you're right. Those memories are saved somewhere. So. Right. Okay. Um. As you go through it, is there any other important uh, issues that people should know about, or important? bits of information that you think they should know about. Uh, just if, get a general idea of how much data you're using. Now, if you do a lot of video editing and you have hours upon hours upon hours, you know, definitely check how much data you have before you actually use Carbonite. Uh, for most consumer side, like I said, it's $49 per year per computer. They don't have a set limit on how much data you use, but now if you do the business package with what we use and what you use, right. uh, you have a set data limit, but you're unlimited on how many devices you are. Right. I think it's 250 gig. Or was it Dave? One hundred sixty-nine dollars for a year, yeah, something like that. I mean, it, it wasn't expensive compared to what we would lose if something happened. Right. And our power has been kicking off for the last month, on and off. So right. I'm sitting there saying, "Ooh, we're in good shape." Yeah, <laughs> we're in good shape. <laughs> so yeah, so one hundred sixty-nine dollars for two hundred fifty gigs of data now. And then I know we have three, four devices set up on your account at and, least. Yeah. And I know on ours, uh, seeing I have it on both our laptops and. And we have a lot of data, and we still have hit that 250 gig mark. So, so well. just to recap, when someone calls you and asks about Carbonite, they need to know how much data they're going to use, what they're looking at as far as what they want to have right. backed up. Right, and are they a business or consumer? I know I've put in, as well as you guys, I know we've done a couple other businesses, and they absolutely love it. Cause yeah. We had one customer that they was paying their internet service provider you know, six months, eight months worth of backups. Yeah. And I just happened to be in there one day, and they mentioned it, and I said, Show me this online backup they're selling you. There was no backup. Oh, yeah. So, I mean, I, I, I pitched in Carbonite. And yep. if you go to Carbonite's website, you can sign up for a free trial. So I definitely recommend that. And I signed them up with it. And they go, well, this is easy. Why didn't yeah. we go this a long time ago? Yeah, yeah. And that's, we had the external hard drives we were saving. But you're right. If there was a fire, it'd all go anyway. Right. And in, even then, it, those external hard drives run out of space, time. And right. As you upgrade your computers, they go out as well. So right. Although it's always good to keep. Easy. Right. It's always good to keep your uh, 
local backup as well because in case your I'm computer breaking rule three, sorry Joe. <laughs> <laughs> in case your internet goes out and your computer crashes, yeah. at least you have another way of getting your data back. Yeah, and I, I feel good with it. It's been really well for us. So on Joe's scale of thumbs up, thumbs down, three out of five stars, eight out of ten. What do you what are you throwing out here? I gotta give this a full five. If nice. I could give six star, I'll give six stars out of five. Really? Million, okay. Yeah. And I gotta say, I agree with that. We've been using it for three, four months now, and it's been great. I don't have to fuss with it. I don't even know it's there. Right. Uh, Cena and I are we're getting ready. I think we're up until almost a year now. Yep. So wonderful deal. All right, good job, Joe. We appreciate it. As always, uh, tell people how they can get a hold of you. And, and again, keep in mind when you do something like this, it's best to call, email, whatever you need to do. Get a hold of Joe and figure out what your requirements are, and then set you right up like you did us. It took uh, probably 30 minutes for you to give me the rundown on it. Yeah. And then you installed it all, and all I have to do is sit there and make sure it's green. Yep. It's cake. Yep. All right. Well, Joe, let them know how they can get a hold of you. All right. You can give us a call at our office at 304-927-3588. Check out our website at amdigitaltechnologies.com. Or be like Dave and like us on Facebook. Yep. I like the Facebook like and the daily specials. Yes. And everything comes with it, and I'm sure Carbonite pops up on there every once in a while. Well, not so much because... You know they they have their setup, but you know we're more than happy to help you. We're familiar with Carbonite enough that we're we're happy yep. to it's get an e you help it's set an up. easy go to, and yes. I, I would highly recommend it. So that's great. It's great to see a five star rating. Uh, you don't do that very often. No, so that that makes it nice. I don't I don't hand this out very often. If it's not very often. I know something about it, so it makes <laughs> me feel good to show. So, all right. Well, if you have any questions or uh, need any more information, then again contact Joe or Cena. They're local. They're here in Spencer, West Virginia. We're coming into Christmas time. Make sure you check out their store. Check out their Facebook page. And look for those specials and start gathering up some uh, Christmas gifts. And we're in the middle of our 12 days of giveaways. So 12 definitely 12 days of giveaways. My God. Yeah, so we're, right. we're still giving stuff away. So be sure to check our Facebook page. We've got all the information there on, on what day, where we're going to give the stuff away from. So. And as always, this show is produced and uh, edited mm -hmm. and taken care of and run by Joe and Cena McDonald with AM Digital Technologies. Make sure you check out their other shows and uh podcasts, and everything else they get into. And if you're shopping, make sure you shop local. Help out our community and our uh, youth and seniors as well. So we'll see you next week, Christmas show possibly. We'll possibly. see what's going on and uh, maybe uh, Joe and an elf's hat or 